Both this scene and the uh, extraordinary amount of alcohol I've had in these last five episodes. Four episodes. Uh, fuck, I don't even know. Uh, uh, welcome back to Nekopara. We're gonna do it. Let's, let's go. Let's do it. Let's go. Yeah, you cut it. Shit out, you fucking vanilla. Vanilla simply sends a hand towards you. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Vanilla. Vanilla, you fucking leave her alone right now. Get the fuck off of her. Right now. I don't like this. It's too rapey for me. Vanilla, I said cease and desist. Vanilla, she was ready the best Moe Moemon in Nekopara, so get the fuck off. Come on, Vanilla, please, I'm begging you here. You gotta give her a shot. Come on, just give her a chance. It is, I agree with Izuki. So, Vanilla, get the fuck out! Get out! Cashew, what are you doing to stop this? No, it's not the opposite of what you should No, stop it! Vanilla! Get <laughs> Guys, remember back in volume one when we said this was a wholesome family fun game? And I think the first episode was called a wholesome family fun game. This is a wholesome family fun game, if fucking ever I've seen one. <laughs> What? Are you- What? Her breathing is ragged and she stares at Vanilla with watery, bitter eyes. Oh my god. Vanilla bot. Get out! You are terrible. You are so awful. Oh my god. Vanilla lifts her lips and with a mocking grin, she looks Suzuki in the eye. Vanilla. I hate you. I hate you so much, Vanilla. I would replace you with cinnamon in a heartbeat right now. I hate you so much. <laughs> Why are you being such a jerk? What is, what is wrong with you? I don't even like your face. Your face right now is the most punchable thing I've ever seen in my life. How do people like vanilla in this game? I don't understand. Seeming to overflow with painful anticipation, she turns his long gaze upon me. She goes and shifts uneasily. No, I need more alcohol <laughs> still. It's not enough. Round two, it's never enough. <laughs> oh god. Excuse me. Uh uh. Hold on, I'm gonna try standing up to see if it's actually any like uh Oh yeah, we're, we're, uh, we're, we're there, we are, de oh, we are deaf, <laughs> I stood up, I took a few paces, uh, we are, we are definitely there at this point. Okay, great, glad I get to leave for London in the morning. I'm recording all these episodes in one session for you guys so I have something to work with while I'm gone. <laughs> oh no. 
でされても素直になれないあずきもエッチなことしたくてたまらないんでしょ I feel like I'm gonna explode. It's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. ここまでされてしたくないわけ All right, let's lean, let's lean back in our chair because that's a little more stable. There we go. Okay. Oh my god, she's actually. Guys, she's actually. She's, she's fucking actually. She's, she's actually a girl. Oh my god, guys, she's fucking actually a girl. Thank god, because at Otakon, she wasn't. So,、uh, yeah. The, thanks, Dan, again. It was a team effort forever. Always a team. I love you. I love you, Dan. You're my favorite. Okay. She glances back and forth between me and the, the bed countless times. Oh, I wonder what's. Oh, oh, poor Zuki. She's like, um, you gonna get the hint, Cashew, or what? Come on, let's go. Like, she's searching for some kind of confirmation of my expression. You can do it, can't you? Or can you? Grammar help? I don't know. No, if I never hear vanilla again, it'll be too soon. Say it, Azuki, say it with all of your bite. In contrast to her desperate demeanor, she turns her defeated and soft features. Soft, what? Okay, towards me. Yay, no vanilla on screen. Azuki, you can look at me. It's alright. Yay! Wait, grab the microphone. No, it's, it's not. It's not stupid. It's not stupid. Oh my god. For, 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 fuck you, Vanilla. Azuki, it's not stupid. It's not stupid. It'll never be stupid. That'll be the best thing to ever happen in the universe. It's all I want. That's all I've ever wanted. Can't you see? You're the only one. For, can't you see that you're the only one for me? I don't know the rest of the lines for this song because I don't exactly remember which song that is at the moment. Baby, can't you see this is not good girl for me? Cause I'm in love with Stacy's mom. There we go. Okay, that's it. That's not, never mind. That song's not appropriate. Fuck it. Yeah, Azuki, you're fine. Let's do it. Come on. You're my favorite, and I don't care. You should be my companion. And none of the other girls should, except maybe Coconut, because Coconut deserves it. She deserves, deserves a shot, and you absolutely do, because you know, you're actually helpful and useful, and I love everything about you. And not enough people love you when they should, and people love Vanilla instead, and they can go kill themselves. <laughs> Why would that drive you? Why would that be bad? Oh, 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 <laughs> my, my heart! Oh my god, the earbuds are out. The earbuds are out. Oh my god, I need a tissue. Oh my god. Oh. I'm so happy. Guys, I'm tearing. I'm starting to tear. I'm so happy. Oh my god, she said it. She said it. Oh my god. She said it. I think she's the first character in this game that's actually said that. Oh my god, she actually is number one. She, he, she was number one. She actually is the best one in the whole game. Not, none of you. You can try, please, guys, right now, if you have an argument as to how Ozuki could possibly. Not be the actual best companion option in the entire game. Please write it in detail in the comments below. She is amazing. She's good at everything. She cares about people. She's stern when she needs to be. She keeps everyone in line. She does her work. She helps people be productive. She looks out and checks up on people when she's worried about them and she always worries about them. And she's the only one that actually said that she. 
Oh my god, okay, the earbuds are going back in. I'm so happy. This made it all worth it. Everything was worth it. This whole this whole game, this whole three volume series has led up to this point. I know I've said it like five times when there was an Azuki scene in this game already in volume two, but this is this is it. I'm really happy. I am so so happy right now. <laughs> Guys, all you troopers get a hug. Yay, that's a hug. It might sound really weird on the microphone, but I hugged the microphone. Yay. Oh my god, you get the biggest, most gentlest hug ever. You know what, guys? Here's a public service announcement that you won't soon forget. The key to the perfect hug is to make the other person feel like they're the only person in the world. And that's what Azuki is for me right now. It shouldn't be that surprising that you feel all oh, that way. No, much more than that, Azuki. You're my girl. And I'm your nut. If I'm as great as I am, Oh, oh my god, that was almost, that was almost an audible. That was almost an audible. Wait, no, that's not this one. Yeah. Wow. Wow. She struggles to get her words out in her quiet, longing voice, and she looks at me. This is not... The usual, always determined Azuki. For me as a girl who I want to protect. Oh, so that's why you were so tired. Okay. Oof. Oh, poor Azuki. Oh. <laughs> oh, she looks up at me with the virgin tears in her eyes. I can see she's begging for forgiveness. Guys, I, I, coconut was bad enough. I would not be able to, I don't know what I would do with myself. I would not be able to handle myself if, if Azuki started crying. Oh, with bleary eyes and a cracking voice, she clings to my chest. Oh. <laughs> now then, what will I do? Nick, cue the scene. Get out! Thank you. Oh, she grins again, but there's no malice in it this time. And smiling sweetly, she turns to me. You're being very pushy today, aren't you? You're just as heavy-handed, though. I pat Vanilla's head really hard, like hard enough to put her through the floor. Like that, kind of hard. And I gently place my hand on Azuki's cheek jar towards me. Huh? <laughs> okay, here we go, here we go again. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Sorry that I'm causing so much pain, Azuki. If you didn't love me, you wouldn't have done those things. You're adorable, Azuki, and I think you've got plenty of charm. When she let her guard down, when she's doing her best to help others around the shop, when she's just being her regular, unaffected big sister self, and when she's showing the cute side of her that I don't normally get to see, I'd never dared to say that in front of her, but I've always thought she was quite charming. Sorry for making you say all of that. And I'm happy you feel that way, Azuki. Can... can I hold you? Azuki. Oh, my hands tingle. My spidey senses are tingly. <laughs> my spidey senses are tingly. <laughs> As I touch her. Oh, that was the wrong... window. There we go. And her bright eyes, she smiles. Oh, her eyes brighten and she smiles happily. I mean, you're right, but what's wrong with that? 
まで言わせといて浮いてんじゃねえよだから<笑>キス<笑> I fucking love her. I love everything about Izuki. That is that is exactly like there's nothing more perfect that you could have said at that moment. It's like, why would you? Come on, that's not what you're supposed to do. Just shut up and give me a kiss. I love it. It's great. Oh, she looks at me with her eyes closed. Yay! I slap my hand across her cheek and onto her shoulder. Azuki ski da do. Uh, yeah, I just said that. Yay! Nick put the points. Yay! I think I'm at like 100 points or something now. Yay! 100 points. Azuki's petite lips and mine gently. Oh, we love each other. It's so cute. Oh, you won't get to see your kiss? Okay. Why? 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 Oh my god. Oh, wow. Wow. She definitely grew, <laughs> which is really funny. But other than that, this is so sweet. I, for I keep forgetting Cash was a fairy princess bedroom. Fuck it. <laughs> Sugar. Volume 1. Sugi looks away from me, annoyed. We changed the sheets and the match. Oh no! Oh no, what happened? What happened that you had to do that? Oh no, God. Why? Oh, and their plates are clean, fluffy ones. Oh, it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. I mean, you can't exactly stand up now, right? What can we do? I mean, you can't exactly stand up. Don't worry, I'll kill her the next time I see her, I swear to god. Don't worry, I'll kill her the next time I see her, I swear to god. Don't worry, I'll kill her the next time I see her, I swear to god. Don't worry, I'll kill her the next time I see her, I swear to god. Okay, Vanilla convinced her to leave Azuki and I alone. Azuki's been like this ever since coming to her senses. I definitely overdid it though, so it's not like I'm one to talk. What did you do? Overdid it? Changing the mattress? What did you do? Kesha, what did you do? Oh no, what did you do? What did you do to her? What did you do to my Azuki? What did you do to my Suzu? Oh, I'll have to make sure to thank Vanilla Jungle again. My companions understand me more than I realize. Azuki, um... What what we did was really reckless, wasn't it? Are are you okay? What did you, what did you do? What did you do, guys? What what did he do? I'm so upset. What happened? I feel so awful. She looks so non like just not happy right now. Oh my god. Wait, I should have, or was that supposed to say I shouldn't have? What? If, if, what? What did, what happened? Oh. 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 I guess she's gone back to being the normal hottie Azuki again. Well, I guess this is just who you are. I mean, I pet Azuki and as a small smile Riley. Oh, what? Are you gonna play hard to get now? Come on. You're the only one that matters. <laughs> What did he do? I oh no! Why, Cashew? Why? She's the littlest one. She's so little. Come on. Tama tama. So, tama tama nanda kara na. Oh my God! What? I'm gonna. I'm never gonna. I'm never gonna be able to sleep again until I find out what happened. Oh, she pouts her face, flushes. Oh, she sounds a bit dejected. It makes me a little sad that she gets this caddy afterward. Oh, no. <laughs> Even though she was calling me master only a little while ago. Oh, well, 
and my bed. I'm really sorry. What did you do? What did you do? I'll never do that to you again. Is it? What the fuck? What the fuck did he do? I'm so livid, and I don't know what did he do. Can you forgive me, or are you an elephant? I asked her dead serious. Oh, sorry. Can can you forgive me? Never again. What did he do, guys? I'm gonna start cry like I'm actually starting to cry because I feel so I'm I'm so upset right now. I'm really upset as to what happened. I don't even know what happened. Oh my god. I can tell by her serious tone that even she's not so sure about it herself. I'm not sure how to respond. I decide to wait for her to continue. What? What? Nick, thank you for putting the, uh, thank you for putting the Bon Jovi in there. Oh my god. I, there's, there's literally, there's, other than knowing, other than finding out what the fuck he did and why, why he did it, I, there's nothing more I can ask from this, from volume two. I think we've got it. We've got it. Other, other than... Other than them being all cozy and being Azuki being like, yeah, I, I love you, so let's be together forever, yay. And then everyone was happy ever after. And it was just Azuki and Coconut and Cashew. I, I mean, she even, she even like silently called him a baka. That was amazing. It's amazing. Tears well up in her eyes as she apologizes in her usual insincere fashion. Oh. She can be annoying sometimes, but that's one of the things that makes her so cute. Oh, and the fact that she's a very caring person beneath it all makes her even more adorable. Oh, her lack of confidence while putting on a strong face is cute too. I gently stroke Azuki's hair. Oh, Koru Koru. As a chuckle wells up inside me. <laughs> I understand. It's alright. Because <gasps> I love you too, Azuki. Oh my god, he said it back! Wow! Oh, I'm so happy! Dad, add a cashew, add a cashew, there you go, yeah, own up to it, yeah, oh my god, dude, own it, fucking, fucking own it, you nut, own it, cashew, come on, come on, look at this, is what, got 100 billion percent waifu material right here, just for you, cashew. Yeah, blissful smile creeps across her face, and she nods slightly in response. Now then, I get lonely sometimes, so I wouldn't mind if you came to sleep over every now and then. Whenever you feel like it, every once in a while, or whatever. As I give her this intentionally vague invitation, I gently rub her cheek. Aww. <laughs> I mean, come on, Zeus, that's all I could ever ask of you. As she pushes her, as she pushes her cheek into my palm. Oh God, I love it. She she lets out a faint laugh that I can barely hear, even at this close distance. This tiny cake girl before me is truly the best one in the entire series. I embrace her delicate body, 
Well, if we're gonna be seeing more of each other every once in a while, I think you should sleep a little closer to me. Yeah. <coughs> Ow, I sneezed. Ah, it's so adorable that I'm allergic to it. <laughs> well, yeah, better not be because you do that for everyone else because you're the oldest. You got the most responsibility. Good night, Suzuki. In the moonlit room, I hug my childish little companion tightly. Suzuki stirs slightly. She brings her lips to my ear. Yeah? What's up? I know. And that's all that matters. Good night, Suzuki. Yeah, I feel the same. How oh, a gentle purring sounds resounds throughout the room. She presses her forehead against my body. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was a good way to end it. A cat goes clumsy head. Oh, sugar, stop ruining it. Oh my god. Sugar's having a seizure. Quick, don't do anything so she dies. <laughs> Cutting you off there, Peach. Good job. Good job, this you, Azuki. Good job, good job, this you fucking piece of shit, Sugar. Oh my god. And then Maple and Cinnamon are like, Wait, does that mean we're next? I don't care about anyone other than Azuki and maybe Coconut a little bit. They do? Oh, that's awesome! How long do they live? I want to know how long they live! Yay! Oh, the whole situation feels like deja vu. I'm more concerned about my maniacally laughing sister than the deja vu, though. That is true. Azuki's the only one that he said he actually loved. <laughs> Don't care. Well, I, I guess, uh, sorry. That's not uh, affairs, is it? Yeah, like not being in any kind of relationship with your older brother, Sugar. I know, it's called Neko Para. Alright, I'm glad I read that wrong. She said pursue. I read that as peruse, as if they were like property, and going back to once again Sugar being a madam of a neck arm. Oh, Nick put in the points. Oh, no. I hate all of you. Nick, put in a Squidward. Thank you. So, uh, I wasn't really trying for that, but... <laughs> I am ugly and I am proud! I am ugly and I am proud! I am ugly and I am proud! <laughs> Is that what he calls it? Hey, <laughs> You really overdid it on the woo. Um, Nick, uh, what does disons mean? Thank you. Uh, the mouse went over. There we go. No, don't. Uh, no, don't listen to me, sugar. <laughs> Sarcastically. You're gonna disturb the neighbors, so lower your voice a bit, okay? I know. 
I know, and I'm running out of recording space, so we gotta end this quick. Buckle up, she says. Yeah, I guess. Oh, we watched Shigura's back, helpless. I can't believe something like this has happened two days in a row. I guess it just goes to show you never know what'll happen in a bakery in Staten Island, Japan. I stare off into the distance and tune out Shigura's insane laughter. Thank God you understand me, Coconut. Yay! <laughs> so great. She shakes Coconut's hand, a baffled expression on her face. I'm probably making an equally puzzled expression right now, and you troopers can bet your ass I am. Oh no, no, cinnamon, no, don't you start instigating stuff now. Oh my god, please, no, it's too soon. It's not even. No, please, cinnamon, at least, at least, at least wait until volume three, please. I'm begging you. Uh... <laughs> Alright, cool. I just cleared up enough recording space to finish the game. Because I just realized that I was down to like four. <laughs> four gigabytes left and I was like, Oh no, we're not gonna make it. It's gonna autocomplete and destroy the finale just like it did for volume one. Well, fucking not today. Because I'm on my A game because alcohol. There we go. Okay, good. Oh, there she goes. Bye. Too late. You already did it. <laughs> I'm glad Mabel has some kind of sense to her. I'm really glad. I wonder how that dynamic's gonna play out in Volume 3. Oh, chocolate fucking late to the party as usual. Yeah, it's the Nick put in the points. It's the party. Yay! There's a party you simply can't mix, mix, it miss. It's a party in my pants. What are you talking about? I already love Azuki and hate all the others. Oh my god. Bye. Go to sleepy time. Bye. <laughs> Good night. Bye. There they go. Alright, girls, wrap it up. We got work to do. For a second day in a row, I gaze out at the chaotic living room. Oh, if you were to say this is how things usually are, you you wouldn't be wrong. I mean, this is the second day in a row now. Even I didn't see something like this coming, but I smile wryly to myself, knowing that ultimately I'm the root of the problem. Cashew, the root of all evil. Ah, I knew it. Let's just get ready to open the shop, okay? I know I'm causing all this trouble, but I'm not gonna do a damn thing about it. <laughs> Fuck, Cashew. I need you guys to actually do your jobs now because, yeah, I watched as they escaped to the bakery floor. Cool. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm just grinning like a fool right now. It's awesome. Oh no, please. Please save it for volume 3 or volume 4. Oh, 
そんなの人に話すもんじゃねえしてか私ももう何も言えねえからほっといてくれああもう畜生惚れたもん負けってこういうことかココナッツも小豆もよきかなよきかな Yes, they are, and you're not, so stop pretending. <laughs> oh, sugar! No, you're not! No, you're not! That's Suzuki! Get the fuck out of here! It's both of your own faults, too, so I hope you're happy. Uh, well, um, I care about everyone very much, so. Damn it, Chocolate, get the fuck back to work. We don't have time for this group photo right now. Everyone get together and say, robots. God, please reiterate yourself once again, Vanilla. I didn't catch it the first ten times. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. 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 That was a great line. Wow. Wow. Fucking dumped. What the fuck? There's so much I've learned from the internet. No! Yeah, all of you. All seven. Of, one, two, three, four, five, six. Sorry, minus Zuki. All six of you back off. Coconut, you can say, but the rest of you back off. Oh my god, look at where their hands are. I can't deal with it. I can't. <laughs> I'm so happy right now, you guys. I'm so happy. She's like, okay, just hear me out. Wait, it's great. And pet petting, but the option's not the option's not available right now. I can't. Oh, how could you ignore any of those faces right now? All right, all right, there, there, there. Oh, perfect timing on the next note. Awesome, everyone is in good spirits as we prepare to open the cafe for the day. Things have been pretty busy up to this point. I'm sure things are only going to get more lively from here on out, too. Well, it is how it is, I guess. I muttered to myself as I'm surrounded by cute cat girls and my little sister. It's time to open Where You At Cakes! And once more, Where You At Cakes, also known as Where You At Cakes, opens for the day. Oh, we did it! Yeah! We beat it! Yay! Oh, it's different! Oh, it's different! Oh, wow! I'll be quiet for the credits.
Four cat panniers. Achievement unlocked. Wow. Oh, that that ending and those credits. Those credits were super adorable. Oh my god, those were amazing. I love. I really like those credits. That was great. And it was a nice. There's such a lovely song for the credits too. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna be able to finish this whiskey before we finish the plug it. Guys, I had so much fun playing this game. This was great. Oh man. So this is gonna be the addressing the audience part, I guess. So volume one is where um, people started to actually find my channel when we played that. And there's a lot of you guys that came after that, a lot of you guys came before that. For everyone that's been around, I just want to say, and it's like, has seen Volume 1 playthrough, the classic with my buddy Dan, best buddy Dan, and Volume 0 following up with that, all the headaches and near deaths caused by cinnamon and vanilla, and then finally going on to It Was All Worth It in Volume 2. This was definitely, by far, my favorite one on its own, but I have to say the experience of Volume 1 was better because I did it with Dan, but as a game by itself, Volume 2 has got to be my favorite. We got we got the best of Azuki and the best of Coconut, and it was amazing. And I just, the entire thing was so adorable. It was too cute for words. It was just really nice, super well done. They did a great job on improving the emote system, and I had a blast, and I hope you guys did too. Um, I'm going to have an amazing time editing this, the rest of it, um, because I've got like six episodes that I have to do now, because I recorded this almost the last half of the game in one go, so. Boy, that's gonna be something. They're gonna be coming out while I'm on my trip to London, Sweden, and also to Estonia. So I'm going to England, Sweden, and Estonia. Um, so these episodes are gonna be coming out while I'm away, so. Hope you guys enjoy them and all the work I put into them. I love every single one of you troopers. Thanks for stopping by and watching this playthrough. I'm going on a little long here, but I hope you'll I hope you'll give me at least that since we finished the game. But we did finish it. I'm very happy about that. So if you liked it, leave a like. That really helps me a lot. And definitely share it. Click the share button. That also helps me like more than I can say. But what matters the most is that you guys are having a good time too. So thanks, all you troopers, for watching. Echo Para Volume Zero. And I will catch all of you in volume three. So I'll see you troopers later. Bye. Boop a doop a doop boom boom. Boop a doop a doop boop a doop a doop boop a doop a doop boom boom. Boop a doop a doop boop a doop a doop boop a doop a doop boom boom boom.